It is crazy to think that if you are Muslim, either you converted to Islam or you are the descendant of someone who converted to Islam. Like for those born into Islam, at some point in your ancestry, your family was not Muslim. That's so crazy. Whether it's your parents, your grandparents, or 10 generations back, one of your ancestors had to go, you know what? This whole Quran thing, this Muhammad, he, he seems like he knows what he's talking about. I don't know. And eventually literally said, girl, we're going to Islam. <laughs> Just thinking about the fact that at some point, the Islam that we practice did not exist. That's subhanAllah. Obviously, there were the previous revelations that we do consider the message of Allah. But like the Islam that we practice now wasn't there. And our ancestors did not practice what we practice and obviously like we've all known these things but when you just sit and think about it and like step away from your perspective of islam in your family right now and look at your lineage from a bird's eye view at some point your family was christian jewish hindu or follower of some polytheistic religion and i am so curious to know what my family was back in the day before we became muslim someone asked me recently if i could meet someone in the past anyone who would it be so i've been thinking about that question for a while now and where i've landed is beside the prophets obviously i would love to meet that one ancestor who made that choice to convert to islam to just sit with them and ask them all these questions of what made them go to Islam? What was their first exposure to Islam? How long had they known about Islam before they converted? What was the final trigger that made them say, that's it, I'm taking my shahada? Did they convert by themselves? Was it the entire family? If they did it alone, what were the struggles that they went through? How did their life change before and after? Or was it a matter of like, everyone else was Muslim and it just seemed easier to <laughs> be part of the religion or it just like made economic sense to be Muslim in that area. So many questions to be asked and then I would end it with, by the way, 12 generations later, we're still Muslim. <laughs> and then give them a high five for making the jump because now I benefited from it. And to just think from that one conversion came generations and generations of Muslims. like thousands if not like tens of thousands of muslims because of that one person subhanallah and then i just think about how impactful it is that we are carrying on the religion and inshallah we will be teaching our future generations about islam if you choose to be muslim and raise your kids muslim you yourself are going to have thousands if not tens of thousands of muslim descendants just wow For those of us who were born into islam alhamdulillah we are very very blessed and if you yourself are the one who converted to Islam, the first in your family, understand just how much of an impact you are having on your future descendants. And that one day, your descendants, just like me with my ancestors, are going to thank you for saying, Ashhadu an la ilaha illallah, Ashhadu anna Muhammad Rasulullah.